more wine, more wine, more wine. So Novak, I'm so glad you moved your career forward because now it's my chance. You've always been there and I didn't have a chance. So congratulations, but thanks God because it's my time now. <laughs> Stricu, za písničkou. So, so Milan, I've got a glass of wine as well, and that's clearly <laughs> Natalia's influence and Zanyak's influence on me. So, um, what I just want to say is, I can remember um, a meeting that we had. I can't remember how many years ago, but I'm guessing it was maybe, maybe eight, maybe nine years ago, when uh, James Cobain said to me, um, "I'd like you to take some time to speak to Milan Novak." And at that stage, um, the company was still based in Wences Square, and um, not in the new, you know, swanky offices in the Palladium. And we sat down and we talked about, um, you know, career and choices and life and everything. And I remember the time I was so impressed um, by your dedication to development and your dedication to your success and your dedication to the business. No way. And it's true, it's true, it's true, Natalia. And I remember coming away and, and saying that to Jane. Nada, it was a great idea that James and Ken founded Grafton 30 years ago. And also, it was uh, heroic uh, from Nile that he spent 17 years in Prague. But uh, I know that Grafton. Uh, is on the place where is it now in market, in, especially in Czech Republic, only thanks to you. And all my thanks goes to you because we are continuing in your work and uh, I hope that uh, you will be happy with our, our, our next steps. Thank you. One thing that I would like to, uh, to remind you of, uh, and you, you kept telling me this, you know, from time to time. Think big. Whatever you are doing uh, next uh, within Grafton, think big and make it happen. Thanks for everything. I would like to say uh, that it is. <laughs> always been very inspirational and pleasure to work with you, Melon. Don't lie, um, don't lie. <laughs> and uh, I would also like to thank you, uh, because I know that if you wouldn't sit at the meeting, in the, at the interview in, back in 2005, uh, it would be probably Jackie Chan who would get uh, my job at that time. So, uh, uh, thank you for that. <laughs> This is uh, the tribute for Milan, I admire and, and respect uh, hugely. Uh, his capacity for red wine drinking is, uh, is quite legendary. Uh, the stories from Vilnius to everywhere are completely erased from my memory. Um, I have absolutely no idea of the mystic we got up to. Bucharest uh, was pretty heavy, but I think Vilnius uh, was probably the, the, the biggest uh, in terms of alcohol consumed uh, and fun. And just to see Milan directing a nightclub at 3 o'clock in the morning, uh, telling people uh, who to dance, where to dance, who to dance with, was probably uh, the strongest memory I have. Uh, and most of the memories are quite weak, as you can imagine, but that was certainly something that stood out. Uh, but listen, I, I, Love Milan incredibly. He's a wonderful, wonderful guy. Uh, so I'm delighted to call a friend. And listen, I, I wish him all the best in his new adventure. Nazda. So Nazi, what do you remember about Milan? When, you, when, you, when I ask you, tell me one thing about the Milan. What would you say? 
Well, I can only Some say this because I'm, I'm so drunk that I... <laughs> I remember my first interview because it, Milan was the second to interview uh, uh, me in Prague for the consultant's job and only thing I can remember was that he was so not interested, he was so over busy and he was so not engaged so I felt like what this actually means, like I never get a job but Milan's interpre interpretation will be that he was so into me and he was so 100% convinced that I'm the future star of the company that I'm actually very thankful that he hired me. Open my glass in case Natalia gives me some more wine or, or Zaniak in fact. So what I would say and um, what really stands out for me um, in relation to you is you have such a strong set of values and um, very dedicated, high integrity, high working, high expectations of everybody that's around you um, and that you have a very, very strong, um, warm, caring heart um, and that you connect really, really well with people. So um, they're the really strong things and now... And I'm gonna cry! <laughs> And how about you? You can drink. <laughs>